Today we play the full story mode in Mario Party 8, but you can move infinite spaces no matter what you roll. This makes the game boards incredibly ridiculous. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you enjoy this video. All right, here we are, Star Battle Arena, and I think it's gonna be pretty funny to have infinite spaces. Welcome to the Star Battle, the very heart of the carnival. Bumpity bump bump water balls. The Star Battle is the main event. Here we find out who's the true superstar of the carnival. Are you our ultimate celebrity? Find out by waging a crazy battle against rivals on five boards. So what's it gonna be? Who dares to outparty everyone else? Bring in our challenger, Yoshi! And of course we are playing as Yoshi today. This should be very exciting. We are a very nice Yoshi over here and we are gonna have infinite space movements on the board. Rise it up to the challenge of your rivals, Yoshi! You must really want that title! And who wouldn't? The superstar gets a super prize! A year's worth of candy! Oh my goodness, this feels like a Mr. Beast video over here. They should just have wheelbarrows full of cash too. Let's get to our first fight. So who's gonna butt heads first? Our first star mashup is, who are we facing off against? Daisy, let's go! The new character in Mario Strikers Battle League. Show us your moves, Yoshi! It's a long way to the top if you want to rock and roll! Ready to go? Then I want to hear everybody say it! Get ready to... Star Battle! Let's go! Let's go! Alright, so the first map that we are playing on is DK's Treetop Temple. This is a very nice first map of the game. And wow, look at how colorful it is. Look at the little dinosaurs down there. That little dinosaur down there actually reminds me of one of the dinosaurs from Mario Kart Double Dash on the GameCube. I wonder if they reuse the same dinosaur. That'd be really interesting to see. Okay, so we want to collect some stars in Mario Party. Hungry piranha plants, deep-rooted secrets, paths that branch off to danger. You'll tangle with all that and more in DK's treetop temple. Let's see who goes first. Smack the dice block, punch with your Wii remote. Let's go. Okay, we got a four. I was thinking, no way, can we be first? But we were first. Yoshi is first. Daisy is second! Here's the gift to get you going! Make the most of these 10 coins! Okay, so very nice. We each start off with 10 coins. Fantastic. On the race to the star space. Where can it be? I'm crazed with anticipation. We can literally see it right behind us. Yeah, look, I can see it there the whole time. Oh, sparkling! So bright the first star! Get there with 20 coins! Our first match begins! Battle Start one. battle one, let's go! All right, so how is this going to go? Let's see, okay, we roll a 10, but it looks like we are not moving only 10 spaces. It looks like we are actually going to move infinite spaces over here. As long as I keep the minus button pressed down, hold on, what way should we go? You know what? Go this way. Got a slow go candy, okay. Wait, do I choose one to jump? Jump now! Okay, let's keep going. Now what, do I choose one to jump? Oh no, we're going down here, okay. Wait, wait, there's a block here. Do I get coins? Can I choose one to go up? Yeah, we got 10, okay, that's amazing, okay. All right, so it looks like we're probably getting a star actually, right? Wait, wait, wait. Wait, there's a cannon here, Donkey Kong is here. Behold the DK barrel, pay five coins to soar. No, I don't wanna pay five coins to soar, thank you very much, but. There we go, we're buying a star on the first turn! Yoshi reached the star! Victory is within reach! Will you trade 20 coins for the star? Yes, I will! That will be fantastic over here. We haven't even played any mini games yet, but I've already got a star. And I think on this board, I think it's the first person to get two stars is the winner. I think that's the way that this works, okay. It's going pretty great so far. Where will the next star be? The suspense is too much to bear. I think I can see it. Where is it? It's up there. Behold, the next star. Get 20 coins and go there first. Okay, let's see where are we going. Well, first of all, we need 20 coins. I can choose to make Yoshi stop moving at any point, but I'd like to get some more coins. Hold on, if we keep going this way, can we keep getting coins? All right, let's just keep going. Oh, 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 oh. and the star's right here, but we can't afford it, unfortunately. So close, yet so far, you don't have enough cash, you need 20 coins. Maybe we'll be able to pass by it again this turn. But let's see, let's see, where's the- Oh, the coin block isn't there anymore! Wait, what's gonna happen with Donkey Kong now? I don't have enough coins, yeah, that's sad. Are we just gonna keep going in circles now? Okay, let's take a different path then. Okay, so let's see, where are we gonna go this time? I guess let's try taking the path up here then, because the path to the right it didn't have any coins for us, so what's gonna happen here? Oh, man! Give me the 10! 
Yeah, another 10 coins. Let's go. Okay, we're doing pretty great over here. All right, now then, are we going to get to get some more coins? Okay, another uh, candy over here. But it keeps telling us that we have too much candy and we have to throw away candy. Okay, let's throw away the Slogo candy because we don't need that. All right, now let's keep moving. If we could get 10 more coins, that'd be amazing. We might actually win the board without a single mini game, which would be hilarious. Let's see. Okay, we're passing by here. No, we don't want any candy. Thank you. We just want coins. Do I want to go in the barrel? No, because the barrel costs money, right? No, thank you. I need to save my money. I got to be able to afford. Oh, oh, right there. It looks like there are more coins here. And give me 10, please. Yeah, there we are. Okay, okay. Let's get going. Okay, we can afford this star now. We just have to make our way over to the star. Wait, where is this star now? Okay. We're heading up this way. I guess we're climbing up. Okay, I guess this time... Oh, wait. But hold on. First, we have to say no to uh, candy. We don't want any more candy. Let's uh, throw away that candy right there. Do you want to discard this? Yes. This is such a weird way to be playing Mario Party. Oh, my goodness. Imagine if you could just move infinite spaces in Mario Party. It completely defeats the purpose of the game, I guess. Hey, Donkey Kong, sorry. We will not be going that way. We will be going to the right this time. And wait, will we pass by the star now? Let's see, where are we gonna go? Wait, the star's right over there. Oh, okay, so it's like we have to do like one more loop and then choose to go the right way. Oh wait, but again, we have to say no to this barrel over here. Man, the background here looks so cool. This is a really cool level design over here. I really like how this level looks. And okay, we're getting rid of another candy over here. Wait a minute, and I just realized, hold on, hold on, hold on. If we go and we buy the star right now, okay, wait, because we have to go to the right over here. So let's see, okay, first we have to say no to this. But hold on, here's what I realized. If we buy that star, then we might actually win the game without Daisy even getting to roll. This is going to seem like the most unfair thing in the world to her. She's like, hey, how did Yoshi win? I didn't even get to roll. Okay, let's see. Wait, right, 20 coins for this star, yes. And hold on, does this mean that we win? Because I think it's first to two stars is the winner, right? I think that's the way that this works. I'm pretty sure that's the way that this board works. Okay, you got a star, very nice. And what's gonna happen now? The jungle spectacular is over! We have a winner! Yoshi got a second star! Daisy didn't even get to roll and we won! That's right, folks! This duel belongs to Yoshi! Congratulations! That was the most unfair win ever! Daisy didn't even leave the starting position! There were no mini games. Yeah, look, she's just so sad over here. She's crying. Daisy, don't cry. That was completely unfair. That was definitely not a fair victory. Don't be sad, Daisy. If someone's cheating like that, you don't have to feel bad about losing. Your results have been saved. Keep up the good work. Yeah, I'm really doing a lot of good work here. Okay, yeah, that was a very unfair victory over there. Okay, but it looks like Yoshi is the winner over here. All right. Yoshi scored the first victory! Hurrah! A fine start! Well done! Wait, is the audience all flowers? What's going on over here? Let's go to our next battle! Who's gonna lock horns now? Our next star mashup is... Yoshi versus Wario! You fight! New stage! We're going to the ocean! Splashy smashy! Do your best! Your pals are watching! Give them reason to cheer! Now I wanna hear it! Get ready to star battle! Oh, okay, the flowers are just at the front of the stage. We do have an actual audience. All right, here we go. Goomba's booty boardwalk. So we want to make it over to the Goomba. I don't know how much money you have to have by the time you make it to the Goombas. But let's see what's going to happen. Treasure on the far aisle. Pirates on the prowl. Blasting cannons. It's time to run the gauntlet in Goomba's booty boardwalk. Okay, so we have to be the first to reach the Goomba with 50 coins to win. Let's see who goes first. Smack the dice block. Okay, let's see. We get a seven. Okay, seven beats four. Looks like we are up first. Hopefully we can earn some coins. Yoshi is first. Wario is second. Wario's face looks pretty funny. Okay, and we get to start with 10 coins, which is nice. But will we be able to earn 40 coins by the time we reach there? Yarr! Reach me and get a star, but you must pay my price. 50 coins, or you'll face the consequences. Our second match begins! Start battle two! Let's go, Yoshi versus Wario. Who is going to be the winner over here? Okay, we of course get to go first over here. So let's get a nice big roll, but no matter what we roll, it doesn't matter because 
We have infinite spaces turned on right now. You got vampire candy. Okay, wait. Oh, 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 yes, 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 yes. Give me that, Ted. Yeah, there we are. All right, let's go. That's beautiful over there. Okay. And I love that we're just running across the entire boardwalk over here. Wow, it really doesn't seem that far when you can move infinite spaces. Is this what it feels like to be a photon? Wait, wait, we're just gonna reach him right now. What happens? Captain Goomba welcomes you. Well run, Yoshi. Er, hold on. Hold everything. No 50 coins for me. And no victory. Yer, tis the case. But I'll give you as many coins as what you can roll up here. Wait. Oh, yes. Okay, perfect! Okay, and I really wonder if this is going to end our turn now, or if we're gonna get to keep going. Now off with you! Back to the start! And don't bother Captain Goomba unless you've got proper tribute! Okay, let's see, so he sends us back to the start- Oh! I've asked you! No landlubber's gonna mess with Captain Goomba while we're on duty! And here come the little Goombas with their bandanas over here, the pirate Goombas! No, Lee! Oh my goodness, they just push Yoshi over here! What are they going to do? They're gonna throw him into the cannon. Goofballs like you are just cannon fodder to us. So kaboom to you. And they throw him into, the I love how you can just see the Yoshi peeking out and they fire me from the cannon. Is my turn immediately over now or do we get to keep going? I really wonder. I get to keep going, that is so funny. That is way too funny. Oh my goodness, I actually can't believe that, that we can still keep going. I thought that that would guarantee end your turn. But I guess since we have infinite spaces, we can just keep going, which is pretty funny. Okay, so let's discard that candy, because we have too much candy. Am I gonna get to roll again with, uh, with the Goomba Pirate over here? Yeah, he really doesn't seem too far when it's like this. Well, I guess it's because we can move infinite distance. Captain Goomba welcomes you! Well run, Yoshi! Wait, didn't I just see you here? It's funny that he doesn't say anything like that. No 50 coins! All right, it'll take me a few more tries, sir. So I just kept walking back to the captain. First I got five coins, the next time I got 10 coins, then I got another five coins, and that brought our total up to 50 coins. And every single time, the Goombas kept coming up to the Yoshi, knocking him over, throwing into the cannon, launching him back, and with our infinite steps, we kept being able to go back to the Goomba Pirate over here, and finally, we should be able to win the board now. And it's so funny that the entire time, Wario is just standing at the starting space. He's like, yep, Yoshi rolled a really big four over there, but it looks like it's now time for us to actually win over here. So now we have 50 coins? Yes, we do. So, have you hold in 50 coins? That's the going price for me most prized possession. Seems you have, SpongeBob, me boy. And we pay our 50 coins. We worked very hard for these 50 coins. We rolled the biggest four possible in Mario Party. Oh my goodness, but here's Yoshi with his star over here. So there's another board that we won without any mini games at all and without the CPU even getting to roll. I wonder in how many boards we'll be able to do that. Well, shiver me timbers, we have a winner. That's right, folks. This duel belongs to Yoshi. Congratulations. Another very unfair victory for Yoshi. That was unbelievable that we won that. Mori is pretty sad about this. He's like, oh, I missed. Yeah, look how ashamed Wario is that he lost. He's like, I didn't even get to roll. All right, so Yoshi is the clear victor in that arena over there. Let's see what our next map is going to be. Now let's see who mixes it up in our third round. Our next star mashup is Yoshi versus Birdo. So it's boy Yoshi versus girl Yoshi. Let's go. New fight, new stage, eat. A house, a haunted manor. Keep your cool, Big Top. How's our player going to muster courage if you can't? Now I want to hear it. Get ready to star battle. And this is one that I don't know if we can win like we did the previous ones. All right, we've got a nice full moon up there. King Boo's haunted hideway over here. This is a very spooky one. Look, we've got crows over there even. We're going into this haunted mansion here. One mischievous monarch. Two terrifying pitfalls and a billion ways to go mad. That is a lot. You'll find it all behind that door. Deranging, rearranging, it's King Boo's haunted hideaway. There are three stars buried in the manor, but you only need two. Go bust them out of hiding. Let's see who goes first. Smack the dice block, punch with your Wii remote. All right, let's go and a 10. Okay, so we're first no matter what, that's amazing. 
Yoshi is first! Birdo's like, wow, wow, am I going to lose now? All right, and we start off with 10 coins. So hopefully we can get 10 more coins and buy two stars at once. That'd be amazing. We want to find King Boo. Right here, fools, right under your nose. Now bring me my 10 coins. Our third match begins. Start battle three. All right, Yoshi's turn to start off. Let's get ready. And a nice big nine. Wow, I'm so glad that we got such a big number. Wait, candy might help. Want some? No, thanks. I don't think I'm going to need any candy. That's fine. Oh, there's some candy over here. In fact, I think I might get too much candy before we can even beat the game. Oh, oh, you know what? Let's go left because it looks like we can get some coins here. And bam, there we go. A nice big 10. Okay, now we can afford both stars. Now we just have to find them. Ah, uh, but now what way do we go? Let's try going down. Let's see where this might take us. Okay, wait, are we just going in a circle? Hold on. Hold on a second. Oh, I think we are just going in a circle. Okay, let's try going to the right this time then. There is that other path over there. Okay, now up or down. Oh, let's go up. Up is the way to go. And uh, keep going up. Okay, and... Keep going up. Oh boy, please bring me to up. Boo? Boo? King Boo is here, please? Yes, yes! Okay, good, good, good. There you go, very nice. Yeah, you found me! Now how about my 10 coins? Fork them over! I've got that star right here. Yes, I will trade you. There we go. Okay, so we got the first star. Now all we need is one more star. Hopefully we can still keep moving. I really hope this doesn't end our turn. All right, Yoshi's very happy to get the first star over here. Man, how good is Yoshi? This is actually unbelievable. This is such a cheap way to play this. Too bad it won't be so easy to find me for your second star. <laughs> okay, we go into the pipe. We come back here. Can I keep going or no? Let's see. Oh, it becomes Birdo's turn. Okay, Birdo, it is your turn. All right, Birdo rolls a three. So let's see. One, two, three. And I think that was three spaces. Hopefully, Birdo moved three spaces there. What a fierce competition! I'm impressed! Why are you impressed? It's been one turn for each of us. Let's check the standings. Bro, we're one turn into the game. What are you talking about? Look at that! Looks like Yoshi is the likely winner! The way things are going, Birdo is sure to lose. Birdo would have lost in the first turn if I could have bought another star. Let's give Birdo a boost! You all want to see a good fight, right? Let's see if this evens the odds! Special bonus. Birdo looks pretty dizzy from this special bonus. What is it gonna be? Dart wheel to take your present. Oh no, what's the present going to be? Let's see. Oh, it might be nothing actually. Oh, oh, Birdo gets some kind of candy. Okay, it's spring candy. I think that lets Birdo teleport to me. I don't think she's going to be able to use that prize actually. I think the game might end before it's going to be Birdo's turn again, hopefully. Little help can go a long way, but yeah, I don't think they're going to have enough help, actually. All right, Yoshi's turn again. Let's go. Okay, just a one, but hopefully rolling a one is enough for us. Hopefully this is a very big one that lets us move infinite spaces. That would be ideal. Okay, do we already have too much candy. Oh no, we can still hold that. Okay, so we have three candy now. And you know what? Let's try going to the right again, because there are some paths here that we didn't take. You know what? Let's try going down, because we didn't go down here. Wait! Is this just the boo right here? Oh my goodness, that's actually amazing! That's so good! Hey, you found me! All right, how about another 10 coins for another star? Yes! And that means that we are going to win now. Poor Birdo! That was a very big one that we rolled over there. Let us go this far. Oh my goodness, this is what happens when you play games without rules. It is very cheap. It is really funny to see, though, that it's like, you can just imagine that the other characters are very upset. They're like, you know, she rolls a one and he goes across the entire board. Horrifying! You got two stars! I'll never live this down! I'll just slip away quietly! Goodbye, King Boo! These chills and spills are over! We have a winner! Too bad the item that was given to Birdo didn't help her. Congratulations to Yoshi! Poor Birdo over here! So sad for Birdo, that's so sad! Man, these graphics look great for the Wii! Alright, very exciting times, man! And that was the best fight that a CPU has put up so far, because it was impossible for us to win that in a single turn. The winner of the third round is Yoshi! Sizzling! Okay, we're headed to the fourth round! Keep your eye on the prize! So, who's going to lock horns in the next round? The next star mashup is... 
Toad! All right, let's go face off against Toad. You fight, you stage, all aboard! Trains are leaving! Well said, Big Top! Our competitors will now hit the rails and battle their way across a speeding train. This is a super fun one. Wait, I think this might be one that we could win in a single turn, if I remember how it works. Look how cool this is! Shy Guys Perplex Express. I don't know what it is about train levels, but train levels in Mario games are always just so cool. <laughs> Who's at the wheel? How long is this train? Are you ahead or behind? Welcome aboard the Perplex Express. Where are we going? Insane! And at the speed of crazy. What a silly line. Want to hear a few secrets about this board? Yes. Okay, so the way that you win this board is you have to give 50 coins to this lady over here. Holly Koopa. Attention passengers, make it here and I'll give you 10 coins. So if you can make it to the front of the train to Shy Guy, you get 10 coins. Okay. So it looks like we'll be able to win this board pretty quickly here. Let's see who goes first. Smack the dice block. Punch with your Wii Remote. Let's see. Good luck, Toad. All right, a five beats a one. There we go. All right, Yoshi is first. I'm sorry, Toad, but it looks like your fate is already determined. Okay, so we start off with 10 coins. We want to get up to 50, and if we can travel infinite spaces, well, I think we're winning this one. Yeah, so there's Holly Koopa. You, you want to meet me, right? Right? Then get me 50 coins. Our fourth match begins. Start battle four. All right, I'm so sorry, Mr. Toad. Good luck, but we just rolled a four, and that four is for the victory here. Do you want some candy to keep your travels on track? No, thank you. We don't need any candy. We can travel as far as we want over here. Oh, hello there. Oh, you've come to meet me, the sweet Holly Koopa. Well, money talks, and I don't hear 50 coins yet. That's all right, because we'll just hit this block. And there we go, a nice 10 points. Oh, and look at the little bandit in the background. I think those types of Shy Guys are called bandits. That's what they are in Paper Mario, if I remember correctly. Okay, we are up to 20 coins, so that's pretty great. Okay, we got some candy. Here's the front of the train now. Now, go no! Need to impress a celeb? You'll need much more cash to sparkle for the glitterati. Oh, glitterati. Okay. Wow, look at how nice the mountains look in the background. That's actually such a nice detail. I'm glad to help a Holly Koopa fan. I'd say howdy myself, but I'm a guy that's too, um, you know the rest. Oh, because he's a shy guy. He's too shy. That is actually so funny. I don't know if I noticed that the first time that I played through the game. Okay, I love how we're just running across the top of the train here. It just says four the whole time. Oh, hey again, Toad. I'm just running by with this four that we rolled earlier. Hey, no, we don't want any more candy. Okay, I don't think that we'll get to hit the block again because it looks like the blocks, they respawn at the end of every turn. But wait, will the shy guy keep giving me money? Okay, we got another candy. Wait, what about the shy guy? Please give me more money, sir. Yes! Yes, it looks like he keeps giving us money. Okay, this is hilarious. This is gonna be a super fast board. Okay, so the way that we do this board is of course we just need to go like this, okay? And then we're just making our way around over here. Gonna pass by Toad. Toad is like, hey, I don't like this turn order. I wanna have a chance to roll too. Why can't I play? And Yoshi's just like, Yoshi! Cause Yoshi's going around. Holly Coop is like, oh, you come to meet me, huh? Well, you don't have enough money yet. And we're just like, all right, we're gonna go get some more money, don't you worry. You're gonna be impressed soon. This shy guy, he's not like, hey, wait a minute, haven't I already given you a lot of money? Like, why wouldn't he just give us all the money at once if we are running by him this many times? Oh my goodness. Yeah, but this is a super fun stage to play normally. But you know what? It's actually hilarious playing through it like this. This is even easier than the Goomba Boardwalk one, because on the Goomba Boardwalk one, it's like, you have to roll a number to get money, but on this one, you're guaranteed 10 coins every time. So here we are. Well, check you out. Are you my biggest fan? 50 coins you are. You're a star in my book. And, oh, you don't even have the option to say no. It just automatically happens. So here we are. I am so sorry, Toad, but it looks like we are the winner over here. You got a star. So it looks like we are the winner over here. That is fantastic. The duel comes to a screeching halt! We have a winner! That's right, folks! This duel belongs to Yoshi! Congratulations! Yoshi's very happy about that. All he did was make a few laps around the train. Toad is like, Wow! I didn't even get to play at all! I'm still over here at the back of the train! Oh, boy! 
Code is so sad about that. He just really doesn't like the turn order over here. Code's like, I wish I could have decided the turn order. And there we are. Yoshi is the winner yet again. Yoshi's having some pretty unfair victories over here. The winner of the fourth round is Yoshi. Unbelievable. I don't think it's that unbelievable. I think we could have expected it with how things are going. Now don't be thrown off your game yet! We're going into your last battle! Will you be our superstar? Is it really the last battle? That's my question. You'll have fierce competition! Your last rival won't let you grab the prizes easily! Our next star mashup is... Luigi! Alright, let's go! That's gonna be a fun matchup versus Luigi. New fights! New stage two tycoons! One town for the taking! Yes, Big Top! An odd battle indeed! In the last fight, you'll be buying real estate, believe it or not! So, here it is! One last time! I want to hear it! Get ready to... Star Battle! And you know, this is a super cool stage. So many people have told me that this upcoming stage is their favorite stage in the entire game. Like, this is a fantastic Mario Party board. I've had a lot of people say in the comments that this is like their favorite Mario Party board, not just in this game, but like their favorite Mario Party board ever. It is a super cool board. You know what? I should try and port this board to a different game. Like either a different Mario Party game or even something like Mario Odyssey or Super Mario 3D World. That could be really cool. Cooler than pirates, scarier than ghosts, riskier than a runaway train. In Koopa's Tycoon Town, you'll play an unbelievably dangerous game, real estate. Dominate the town! And then real estate does have a lot of tax advantages and there are a lot of benefits to it, but man, it is a lot of work to own and manage a property. It's not something that I'm interested in doing. In this duel, whichever one of you first earns four stars will win! Let's see who goes first! Let's see, Luigi, we get an eight and a two. Eight beats two. Nice try, Luigi. Yeah! Okay, hold on, so we start off with 10 coins each, and we need four hotels, but wait! Are there three total hotels, or four total hotels on the map? Okay, so if you pass by a hotel, it's whoever pays the most coins, they own that hotel. But if someone goes by and they pay more coins, then they own the hotel. And if you put enough coins into a hotel, then it becomes a level two hotel. And then you get two stars worth from it. Let's see, let's hit the block, okay, a three. Not a very big number, but luckily for us, three also means infinity, so that means we can keep going. You know what? Let's make our way through the town over here. Welcome, Yoshi! This hotel could be yours for an investment of only one coin. Want to invest? Yes, I do! How many coins? I would like to invest one coin, please. Thank you very much. And for one coin, the owner of this hotel is now Yoshi! Thank you very much. Wow, what a great investment. Imagine buying a hotel for a single coin. But well, I guess it depends how much the coin is worth. Yoshi needs only three more stars to win. Keep up the good work. Hopefully we can keep getting more and more stars. Well, look at everyone just around here. Oh, oh, and we cross the crosswalk and give me something nice here. Bam, there we are. All right, 10 more coins. Beautiful over here. Wait, what is this over here? Rich confections right here. Want some tycoon treats? No, uh, we don't need anything. We are happy with what we have over here. Oh, and here's another hotel. Welcome, Yoshi. This hotel could be yours for an investment of only one coin. Yes, I would like to buy one more hotel, please. Thank you very much. And another hotel belongs to Yoshi now over here. Okay, so this means that we now have two stars over here. Man, this is such a nice level. Oh, and look how small those uh, trees are. But yeah, as I was saying, this is such a nice level, but it looks like we might not be spending a lot of time here, actually. Oh, what way do we go? Oh, I love how the car actually stopped for us. That's so nice. Okay, I guess we'll go around this way, because if we can go around this way... Oh, and... Give me something nice, please. There we are. All right, very nice. Okay, it's I love how the truck is stopped for us. That's amazing. Oh, and look at the construction going on in the background, too. Love how Yoshi still looks both ways, okay? All right, I don't need any of that. No, thank you. But I will go here and hold on. Welcome, Yoshi. This hotel could be yours for only one coin. I will buy it. And you know what? Let's invest one coin into the hotel. And I think those might actually be all the hotels. So I think we are going to have to try and level up one of our hotels to level two. I guess we should probably go to the first hotel and invest all of our coins into that. Yeah, we only need one more star to win. We're in the home stretch, but I need some more coins maybe. That Oh, oh, and I love that Luigi's just standing there at the start in the background. That's so funny. Actually, you know what? 
First, let's go up this way, because I've never gone up this way before, so let's see what's here. I love that there's just a Koopa sitting on the bench over here. Okay, we already own this one. Welcome, Yoshi. I don't want to change the number of coins I have invested. Okay, and now, let's try going down, because I don't think I've gone down this way before. Just so we can see, like, all the possible paths. Oh, and there's a Koopa over there with some bananas, it looked like. Okay, we got another candy over here. Wait, is that- oh, it's not too much candy yet. Okay, but let's go here, then. We're gonna go this way, and you know what? Let's invest all of our money. Welcome, Yoshi. You already own this hotel. Would you like to change the number of coins invested? Yes. I'm going to invest all of my money now. Maximum possible amount of money. I don't know if the hotel's gonna grow to level two. I don't know if that's enough money. Let's see. The owner is still Yoshi. Wait. Yeah, it's a level two hotel. Okay. Okay, so once it reaches 20 coins, it's a level two hotel, I guess. Okay. Very nice. All right. Wait, does that mean we win? Okay, because we get a star. I don't know if we even have to keep moving. I guess this is another map that we can win without our rival even moving, which is kind of funny. <laughs> stop this tycoon brutality! This spending must stop! We have a winner! That's right, folks. This duel belongs to Yoshi! Congratulations! Poor Luigi. Oh my goodness. Yeah, so it looks like Yoshi is really the real estate tycoon master over here. He's like, oh no! Ha ho! Mario, you got to help me! And Luigi's so ashamed here. He's got his hat covering his eyes here. So sad. He couldn't buy a single hotel. He couldn't invest a single coin even. Luigi just didn't know where to begin. And we were told that that is the final board. But some of you might know if you've seen this game before that this is actually not the final board. Huzzah! Yoshi, get on stage. You've won your battles. You're the ultimate celebrity. But there's still more. This is like a Mr. Beast plot twist where the video doesn't actually end. As winner of the star battle, you've won the carnival's highest honor, the one and only superstar. Time for your real prize. Surprise, way better than candy. Sweetest thing ever. What? Oh, cool. It's the star rod over here. You've let the hat out of the bag, my friend. But it's about time. Your real prize is this star rod, just like Paper Mario. Don't mistake it for the must-have accessory of the year. The star rod packs serious power. Frankly, it's a huge relief to find a superstar to hang on to it. So without further ado, hold on. Oh, we all recognize that laugh over there. And I wonder how hard the last board is going to be. Are we going to be able to do something ridiculous? Wow, Yoshi. Think you're the superstar? Really? Don't make me laugh. <laughs> <laughs> He's laughing a lot. Now, if you were fighting in the doofus battle, I'd bow down and call you number one. That is a serious burn there. Bowser turns to this guy. But this was the star battle, and I see only one superstar. Me. So that rod, mine. Better cough it up right now. This guy looks terrified. His face looks like something out of the Mario and Luigi games, like Mario Luigi Superstar Saga. And Bowser's got the star rod now. Want it back? Come and get it. Or are you chicken? <laughs> How was that chicken impression? You guys let me know in a comment if that's good. Oh, and all of a sudden Yoshi jumps on a star over here. What are we, Kirby or something? My goodness. Oh, and this guy's coming back. Wow, I didn't know his hat has a propeller like that. Is he gonna come join us in the sky now? Bowser's taking the star rod and he's stolen the spotlight. It's the end of the world. This is good for his show's rating. We've been befouled by Bowser. He's walked all over us. Oh, the stink of defeat. But wait, we have you. Help us make things right. So let's go. We're taking this star battle to the star. And away we all fly. All right, wait. I thought it was supposed to be called Bowser's Warped Orbit. Hold on, it looked like a K instead of a B at the start over there. That was really weird, actually. Okay, but hold on, for this one, I think I might actually have to let my opponents go once. Okay, and hold on, here's Bowser over here, because I think the point is that you want to actually catch up to your opponents. I think that's the point of this, if I remember correctly, but let's see. Whoa, didn't see that coming. What a crazy trip. It looks like Bowser has transported us to his evil space lair. Looking grim, what will become of us now? Whoa, welcome Yoshi. You sure seem fired up about this star rod. If you could somehow beat all my loyal servants, I'll give you the star rod. Impossible, I know. Show me your worst, Hammer Bro. Are you more warped than us? Whoa. Wait, Hammer Bro? I guess I'm facing off against Hammer Bro now. Hello, Hammer Bro. Yoshi versus Hammer Bro. Oh, I like the light around him. That's pretty cool. Here we go. The battle with Hammer Bro for this star rod is about to start. 
Beyond space, beyond time, and beyond decency, we're in the blackest hole of all! Bowser's warped orbit! It's seriously sick and twisted! We're in Bowser territory now! You'll play by his rules! So you'll start with three stars, then earn more the Bowser way! Stealing, steamrolling, savagery! You'll need two kinds of candy! Bowser candy and bullet candy! Shout out on these to steal stars from your rival! Okay, wait, the Bowser? Oh, wait, wait, this is gonna be the most ridiculous board ever. This is gonna be ridiculous. Oh my goodness, okay. So, Bowser candy lets you smack two dice blocks and you'll steal two stars from your victim. Bullet candy lets you go farther. You'll get three dice blocks, so you get to roll three times, but you only steal one star. But, no matter what we roll, I think we have infinite spaces. Which will steal you more stars, a short rampage or a long snipe. Win this match, you'll need to steal all of your rival's stars. Wow, so this might actually take a few turns. We might actually have some mini games. Let's see who goes first. Smack the dice block, punch with your Wii Remote. And what do we get? I actually want him to go first. Okay, five, we get a three. Okay, that's perfect. Hammer Bro is first. Yoshi is second. Or wait, we actually want, uh, do we actually want to go first? Wait, do we start with candy? Or do we have to find candy or buy candy? Because it looks like there are candy shops around here. But hold on, hold on, hold on. How does this work? We start with candy? Okay, our sixth match begins. And this is really our final match here. Okay, please go ahead, Hammer Bro. What do you roll? A two, okay. So one. Oh, oh, whoops, whoops. Okay, it looks like he actually moved only one space over here. Wait, if I catch up to him, do I get anything? Or do I have to use the candy first? Let's see. Oh, nothing happens when you pass by him. It's that, uh, you need some candy and then you can catch up to him. Okay. Okay, so we got twice candy. Wait, 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 wait. But hold on, hold on. We need that good candy. Okay, we get 10 coins over here. Hold on. We need, a uh, Bowser candy and the other candy. We have to go get some candy over here. Okay, so we're going through here. This looks so much like something out of Sonic. Okay, but let's see. Let's go buy some candy. You gotta crunch some candy if you wanna be like Bowser. Yes, let's do it. Hey, what kind of candy do we want? Please choose the candy you want. Let's do... Okay, Bowser lets you steal two stars. And Bullet Bill lets you steal only one. Okay, so we're obviously going for this one since they're the same price. And since we can move infinite spaces no matter what. Okay, so let's take this. And hold on. We want to get close to the other guy, but we don't want to pass him. Because you only want to pass them once your, uh, you know what, is active. Wait, and what's this candy? Ah, vampire candy. Okay, that's too bad. We have too much candy, we have to throw some away. Oh, and we have a bullet bill candy, okay, so this is perfect, so we have everything we need. Okay, so we should be able to steal two stars. We just need two more turns and then we'll be able to steal the stars. Okay, this is gonna be great. Okay, wait, let's, uh, uh, do I wanna buy some more candy? No, we have enough, okay, let's just stop here. What if you land on a question mark space? What does this do? Get ready for a reversal, no! No, oh wait, actually, that's all right, because if he goes just past us, then that'll be fine. Let's see, where do we want him to go? We want him to basically stop on the blue spot. That'll be perfect, okay. So you can go ahead, Hammer Bro. Please roll. You get a one, but his one actually lets him move a bit farther than one. He buys some candy, spends five coins on a double dice over here, but we're gonna do something crazy here. Okay, he lands on that, but look at what we are gonna do here. We're gonna do something very, very evil over here. We are going to use the Bowser candy over here, or you know what? Let's use the Bullet Bill candy first, and we'll finish him off with the Bowser candy. I think that might look even cooler. Okay, so let's use this one first. We're gonna transform into a Bullet Bill now. Oh my goodness, Yoshi looks hilarious with that. So, oh, let's roll. We get a five. Oh, and you get to roll three times, I'm pretty sure. Okay, five, two, and seven. Okay, 14 is enough to pass by this guy, which is good news for us. Okay, we took one star from him. Now, let's just stop... Right there, that's a good spot to stop over there. Okay, we stole one star, he's down to two stars. We only need one more star than, than uh, or sorry, we only need to pass by him one more time with the Bowser thing active, and then we can win the game. Okay, so let's see, where is Hammer Bro going? Oh, he's using his double, uh, his double dice over here. And how far is he going to go? That is the question. Let's see, he gets an eight and a 10. That is a nice big number. So we want him to stop just in front of us, if possible. What does the DK spot do? I don't know what happens if he stops up. Oh, no, 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 no. I want him to keep going. Okay, I want him to keep going. Let's see. I don't want him to land on a question mark space. 
Because if you land on a question mark space, then the order is reversed. Actually, it doesn't matter. Let's just have him stop when he lands here. Whatever he lands on. Okay, he lands on just a red. He loses some money over here. Okay, and guys, this might be the game over here. I don't know if there's going to be a final Bowser boss also. I'm expecting that there is going to be one. But let's try this. We will, of course, use the Bowser candy over here. Okay, let's get ready. Yoshi takes the Bowser candy. And he transforms the Bowser like this with Yoshi's head. But then he puts on the Bowser head like that. It's so funny. It very clearly looks like a Bowser suit instead of actually being Bowser. Okay, and wait, 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 wait. This means that we're now gonna catch up to him. Oh, it's so funny seeing Bowser going through the tube like that. And here we go, we caught up to him, we get his two stars. And wait, oh, hold on a second. You know what I think I could have done? Wait, I think last turn when I was the bullet bill, I think if I just kept going for infinite spaces, then we could have kept passing by him and we would have been able to steal all of his stars in a single turn, because look at this. Oh no, never mind, you just pass by him and then you don't steal more stars from him. That is actually surprising. Or wait, maybe it's because he's out of stars. Maybe if he still did have stars, then when we pass by him, then we would be able to keep stealing his stars. Because yeah, right now, look, he's just dizzy like this. And we just pass by him like it's nothing. But maybe if he still had stars, then we would keep stealing them. But yeah, right now, I guess that we are the winner now, right? We're up to six stars. Hammer Bros down to zero. Yoshi transforms back. Whoa! Whoa! That last hit and run did the trick! Now Hammer Bro has zero stars! That's right, folks! This duel belongs to Yoshi! Congratulations! Very good job, Yoshi. Yoshi! And Hammer Bro's so sad. It's like, oh man! And. What's gonna happen? Is there a boss fight against Bowser now or something? Okay, Hammer Bro's very sad that he lost here. There's gotta be a final Bowser boss fight, right? Your results have been saved! Now beat Bowser and get back that star rod! I guess we do face off against Bowser, right? Hold on. Whoa, you useless dolt! You call yourself a henchman? You're a stenchman! Nice one, Bowser. Oh my goodness, Bowser is a complete savage in this one. He is just being so rude to everybody. And he has so many funny puns, too. Am I gonna face off against Bowser now? Who needs this dumb rod anyway? I bet it's total garbage. Take it. I don't want it anyway. Wait, do I have to face off against him? Is there a minigame or a battle or something? Wait, he doesn't just give it to me, does he? I always keep my promises. Uh, well... Nah, who am I kidding? Only the superstar deserves it. And that's me, Bowser. Is he gonna take it back then? Let me show you how a true superstar does it, Yoshi. You against me, cold depths of outer space. Now! And Bowser's laughing. All right, let's face off against him. Wow, literally our first mini game of the entire video is the final boss fight. Bring down Bowser. Wave the star rod over your head to build up energy. Shoot once you're charged up. Watch Bowser carefully. When he launches an attack, go on the defensive, even if you're charging up. Who is who? Let's see who's who. Player one is Yoshi, Bowser's a CPU, okay. All right, let's see how this match against Bowser here is going to go. Hopefully we can do all right, all right, let's start off. Go, oh, move, move. Okay, let's charge up and go. Very good. Charge up and, oh, move, Yoshi. Okay, charge up and go. Very good, get ready, move. Okay, good job avoiding those, now charge up and go. Now let's see. I'm expecting an attack from Bowser soon. Oh, oh, okay. I'm like, why are we not moving? Something happened. Okay, there's electricity coming out of his ears over here. Oh, oh, get ready for some cannon shots. Move, Yoshi! Don't stop. Good. Now go, okay. Now get ready, another attack soon, okay. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let's go, 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 Okay, charge up and bam. There we go. Let's see another attack on us soon. Let's see, I just want to retreat over here. Now go, whoop, whoop. Cause I wanna make sure that we don't accidentally go too far because I think there is a limit for how far left and right you can go. So I don't wanna get trapped or something like that. Okay, Bowser's starting to get angry now. Wait, is this the one where he shoots out lasers? Hold on, okay. Oh boy, this is starting to look scary over here. Wait, is it gonna spin around and shoot now? This looks terrifying. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, we're hit, we're hit. Okay, let's just charge up. Oh no, oh no. Yoshi, Yoshi, you can't stop now. Go. Okay, let's see, where are we going? Oh, nice hit, bro. Wait, can I go again then? Go. Oh, this seems like the best strategy, charge up. And right when he's about to attack, 
that's when you hit him because ah! <laughs> I was gonna say because that stops him but there we go this should finish him off we should be all right right there we go okay with two HP left we defeated him very nice this was such a ridiculous way to play this game I don't know what I expected going into this but I didn't think that we'd be able to win basically every sing- No, not only basically every single board, but we won every single board without a minigame. Well, I guess except for the last one. You have the final boss fight minigame. But that's so funny that it's like you win Mario Party without even playing any minigames except for the final boss. Now that was the best star battle that I've ever seen. What a finish. Thanks to some super moves, Yoshi has won back this star rod. Now that's a real superstar! Who can doubt that Yoshi is worthy of the Star Rod? Well, anyone that thinks that our victory was a bit unfair because we used cheats. Let's announce it once and for all! Who wins this Star Rod? And a year's supply of candy and wheelbarrows and suitcases full of cash? It's Yoshi! Let's hear it for our superstar! My hat's off to you, but your hat is on! And Yoshi is the winner! You're the superstar! What an incredibly cheap way to do that. That was so ridiculous. I really recommend my video where we play all minigames in Mario Party 8. The minigames in Mario Party 8 are actually fantastic. And it is sad that we didn't get to see any of them in this video, so you might enjoy that video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have an absolutely fantastic day ahead of you. And take care, everybody.